Today we're going to go over f six. It was five, I added one. We're going to go over six pocket knives, all folders today. Expect more of these videos in the future because knives are my favorite thing. Okay, there we go. So we're going to start with the first two are both Kershaw's. So the first one is the Kershaw Shuffle. Shuffle one. Don't like the Shuffle two. Shuffle one. You have this really amazing pry bar. I like. You got a nice bottle opener. Very thick all the way across the back. It's a liner lock. It's a manual opener, but it moves really fast. And you just have this really nice shape. It locks into your hand. My whole hand's on it. Little fingers back on the little pry bar. But whole hand's on it. Whole thing's curved. So it just really cuts and slashes through whatever is in its path. Slide your thumb up, really get on it. Really does nice work. A little bit of chopping. Really nice up close knife. It does whatever you need it to do. The other one's sort of a Kershaw classic. The leak. It's the only of the flippers on the table. It has a nice little flipping stud back here and then also thumb studs. The rear one's just as fast. It has a lock back here to lock it closed, which I never used. All steel. A really nice knife. Got a nice bit of jimping on the back. A little bit of jimping here to your flipper arm. Locks in the hand really nice. Got a really wicked little point on it. A fairly flat blade. Cuts really, really nice. Holds its edge really well. But not very wide. Not a bad defensive knife, though. Maybe better to cut through something soft. Something like a thin rope or something. Just not real heavy work for that one. The other one is the exact opposite, always ready for heavy work. This is the Cold Steel Tough Light. I have the serrated. This also comes in a mini tough light. And the mini and full size both come serrated or playing edge. Extremely thick folding knife. Not very heavy. Nice sheep's foot blade. Just just cuts through anything. Just locks in the hand. Whole hand fits on it. Cuts through anything. I have pretty good sized hands. Only extra large gloves. Sometimes large. Then we have two smaller ones. Another cold steel. Cold steel recon one. Again, a little manual. This one's a back lock, same as the last one. About all cold steels are. Two fingers on this one. Two fingers and a thumb. But the jimping on here, you have all across in here. Not that you need it. And then you have it all across the back. So it's not going anywhere. It's a little guy. Fairly thin. Not too bad though. A little bit of size to it. Nice to drop in a dress pants pocket. Suit jacket, vest. Nice little guy, very. The texture on here is just extreme. Be textured. And we have a Spider Co. A little ladybug. Get it. There we go. Also in a serrated and playing. I have the half serrated. A knife you can really get up on this thing. Grab the little spider hole and you can put your whole hand on it that way. Or to go back a little bit, you can get I get two. Smaller hands might get three. Kind of get three. Really nice little knife. Little tiny guy. Not their smallest. The bug is smaller. The honeybee might be smaller too. This is a ladybug. We'll back lock on that one. And then the last one, number six, the one I'm carrying right now. That's the Benchmade. 
940-2. Use the Benchmade Axis Lock. Pinch it both sides and swing it down. Manual opener. Extremely lightweight. Extremely weird blade shape. Give you a really nice tip. Punch and drill extremely easily. Very wide all the way down to the tip. Wide all the way across. It's actually not the widest point. The widest point runs right along here. Steel liners, both sides, all almost all the way down. Steel liners run all the way here, all the way to here. So most of the way, we'll pass half. So nice and light, a nice strong knife too. Just instant open, holds an edge forever. This one is S30V. It's a really nice. That's probably my favorite right now, although I do carry this one, a little cold steel, in my shirt pocket quite a bit. And then lastly, we're going to throw in number seven. Down in my pocket, my defensive knife is also a Benchmade, the Benchmade Infidel, which is an automatic, double action, double edged, double playing edge. This is used the D2 steel. Which is a heavy duty tool steel. It holds its head pretty well. Not the best. Pretty well. But extremely tough. You can just dig out nails with this thing. Extremely fast, extremely tough. I keep it extremely sharp because I don't use it for really too much of anything. It's my defensive knife. It comes out all the time because I like to show it off, but basically it is my defensive knife. And then this is my knife for doing anything, or whatever else is, happens to be in my pocket. So that's my seven, turned out to be. Seven that I carry the most. So we'll probably see some more of these videos because knives are my favorite thing. So stay tuned for those. See you in the next one.